Fertility is one of these demographic things that, you know, usually it moves at this glacial pace. But anyone who's been following, you know, recent developments, fertility has actually been trending down in the last few years. And even this year's numbers that were discussed in the, you know, on the pages of the New York Times recently, uh, there are some really interesting developments here. And the questions, of course, are how do we think about what's going to happen going forward? Most of us know that fertility is an incredibly important driver of long-run financial health for Social Security and other related programs. So this is a topic which is really central as we think about these issues. And I am absolutely thrilled that we have a wonderful panel of presentations this morning. Uh, Karen Glenn from Social Security is going to start off by sort of setting the stage and laying out some of the basic fertility trends and some of how this interacts with SSA's thinking at the moment. Uh, then we're going to have Martha Bailey, who's in the midst of writing a book about long-term trends in U.S fertility. So she's actually going to have twice as much time as the other panelists because she has an entire book length of things to try to fit into her 30 minutes. Uh, so she's going to then talk about some of the longer historical developments and put the current developments into context. Okay. Then we're going to turn to Casey Buckles, who's going to tell us about some of the work that she's been doing on recent fertility developments and understanding some of the economic determinants, followed by Caitlin Myers, who's going to actually talk about the role of changes in abortion policy and how that might have some implications for thinking about what the fertility numbers look like going forward. And at that point, technology willing, uh, we're going to have Steve Goss from the Social Security Administration, who was on the phone listening, uh, jump in and make a few, pre few, few presentations. We have some slides, and he's going to try and talk about how some of the work that we've just heard intersects with work that's being done by the technical panel and being projected at, the, at SSA at the moment.